Hello and welcome to Barbless TV. Today, we're at Manningford Trout Fishery with Ben Bangham on the hunt for monster brown trout and also have a look at what Manningford has to offer as one of the best stillwater trout fisheries in Hampshire. It's the middle of winter, it's been incredibly cold. Last night there was a heavy frost, but today, as you can see, bright sun, it's warming up a little bit. The fish should be on the move. It's a very shallow fishery anyway, so I'm gonna start with a floating line. I've got one of the new airflow ones, which floats very high, lovely line. I've teamed it up with a Sierra Stonefly, nine foot six, seven weight rod, just to try and get that little bit of extra distance, get out towards some of the islands. And I'm gonna start with a small lure, the cat's whiskers. It's a great winter pattern. Should be a good starting point. Right, let's go have a fish. Manningford Trout Fishery, set in the heart of a Pusey Vale, is fed by the pristine waters of Hampshire's River Avon. The fishery boasts three lakes and a two mile stretch of single bank river fishing. Manor Lake is the biggest of the lakes at about four and a half acres. Squires Lake is a more intimate lake and covers an area of 1.3 acres. Manningford also has a third lake that is solely for catch and release. So when you've bagged up but still want to put a bend in your rod, you can while away the rest of the day on their catch and release lake. So we've had a couple of casts. We had a lot of rain yesterday and it's coloured up the water. The fishery is fed by the River Avon. The Avon's coloured and the colours come into the lake. Now, I started with your traditional cat's whiskers but putting it into the water, I can't really see it and I just wonder whether a darker fly will be more effective. So I'm going to swap over, I'm going to stick to the same fly, cat's whiskers, but I'm going to have a black wing instead of a white wing and see how we get on. So, as you can see, today I've got my lures. These are what I normally take out for a day on in the winter. We've got the blobs and the boobies, then you've got your big things, damsels, more boobies, and some small little mini lures. Fantastic for winter conditions. Big, bright, bold. Um, as we've already said, the water's quite coloured, so I'm going to stay away from the brighter colours. and I'm going to go into the blacks and the darker colours, because I think they'll stand out better in this, these water conditions. So this is the one I've got my eye on now. As I said before, it's a cat's whiskers. It's a cat's whiskers but it's with a black wing, give more of a silhouette. So I'm going to put this on and have a cast. All the lakes have a good head of both rainbow and hard-fighting brown trout. But there's always a chance of knocking into one of their very special blue trout. All the fish stocked in the lakes come from their very own Manningford Trout Farm, which rears over 80 tonnes of fish each year. Fish are stocked from two pounds and up throughout the year and it's not uncommon to land rainbows, blues and browns of eight pounds plus. Ben's new fly choice seems to be working and he starts to consistently pull out rainbow after rainbow. Manningford fisheries are fed by the waters of the Avon and as already mentioned, two and a half miles of this pristine intimate chalk stream is available for you to fish. The River Avon is a delight for any angler 
Ideal for a light outfit, the river is a perfect opportunity for classic sight fishing with both nymph and dry flies. As well as single day tickets and season tickets, Manningford Trout Fishery provides amazing corporate and group fishing days. These days are tailor-made to suit you and your groups. So if you have a group of 6 to 40 people, want some amazing fishing and great hospitality, Manningford Trout Fishery truly is the location for you. So we're coming to the end of the day, we've had a few small rainbows on lures but we want one of the big browns that Malcolm breeds. They're really good, really big but they tend to become out on the more imitative patterns, the more natural ones. So we've come up to the quiet end of the lake which is renowned for the browns. We've got a small buzzer on, one of my favourites, I'm going to see if I can get a big one. Looks like our patience has been rewarded. We've got something on here. Feels like an absolute lump. We're going to be fishing the buzzer about five minutes. Just working it back really slowly. And this is taken. I can't even move it off the bottom. So I think it could be a brown. I tend to hug the bottom. So let's get him in. Fingers crossed. There you go. What a fish. This is why we've come here. Look at that. Whoa. That is an easy double figure fish. Look at the size of that. Well here you go. This is why you come to Manningford Trout Fishery. A thin perfect double figure brown. What a fish. I know Malcolm's put a few of these in recently. There's a few more to go in. I mean, wow, look at that. That's got to be a reason to come down here. What a fish, what a day. For more information or to book your trip to Manningford Trout Fishery, why not visit their website at www.manningfordtroutfishery.net. Well, that just leaves me to say thanks for watching, but please subscribe to our channel by clicking this link for more great fishing films. And if you know of a fishery that would like us to visit, why not drop me an email at n.brown at techsecmedia.com. Tight lines everyone, and we look forward to seeing you again soon on our Barbless TV adventures.